I just want to reiterate the Premier's condemnation of the blockade there at the border between Alberta and the United States. Cabinet Minister Doug Schweitzer joining a growing list of people condemning the protest happening at the Coutts border to the U.S. as the opposition calls for two UCP MLAs who supported the illegal blockade to be booted from caucus. Calling it an illegal blockade himself, Schweitzer explains when he was Justice Minister, this was the sort of thing they had in mind when introducing Bill 1, the Critical Infrastructure Defense Act. 110 percent. Uh, the Critical Infrastructure Defense Act was designed to deal with protecting critical infrastructure in the province of Alberta. We've seen rail blockades, we've seen highways be blocked, and that's exactly what the intention of the bill was, to provide law enforcement with greater tools to deal with illegal uh, blockades in Alberta. Meantime, two UCP MLAs have come under fire, one of them Shane Getson, vocal about his strong support of the illegal blockade on social media, making comments like the province needs to scrap the QR code, drop the mandate, and end the vaccine. While the other, Grant Hunter, participated in the rally, saying on Facebook he brought his grandkids to the Coots border to show them the importance of standing up for freedom and liberty. This is going to be an issue that our caucus needs to talk about. Uh, I think disappointed that Grant Hunter made the decision to go there and participate in that illegal blockade. I'm looking forward to hear Grant Hunter's reasons for being there. The NDP is calling on both Hunter and Getson to be booted from caucus. This is dangerous and irresponsible language from an elected official. Mr. Getson cannot be permitted to spread anti-vaccine misinformation and fearmonger about serious food shortages while supporting an illegal border blockade. In a statement of City News, Hunter calls the illegal blockade a peaceful protest, saying it's not a blockade which stops people from moving freely, empathizing with the frustrations truckers and others have faced. Getson, meantime, did not provide a statement in time for broadcast. In Calgary, Safe Kaiser, City News.